what's going on guys Zio here with another bless unleashed guide today we're going to be going over the five player layer archon of fire like comment and subscribe for more bless unleashed content as soon as you guys come in and try to go towards them a cutscene will play pretty much just like an intimidation act right here real quick guys i do stream every day on Twitch at twitch.tv slash Mr. Zeo from 3 p.m. to 9 p.m. Eastern. If you guys have any questions or just want to stop and say hi, the link will be down in the description. So he has a lot of different attacks, but he is basically a fiery Cyclops, like the Cyclops over in the weekly bosses in Tristeza. He will slam his trident looking weapon towards whoever has aggro, and sometimes he will even pull 180 and slam his weapon. He'll also swing it from left to right two to three times. The biggest thing about this fight is when he curls himself in like that, make sure to always stay behind him. You never want to be in front of his of this attack because then you'll be frozen and he'll do an eye beam from left to right across the whole room. The only way to dodge it is if you're behind him. If you do get caught by the eye beam, a quick time event will start and you need to nail it because if you don't, the eye beam will kill you instantly. As soon as you get the quick time event, roll behind him so that you don't die. So there's this mechanic as well where he will shout and stun everyone in the arena. When he does this, another quick time event will pop up as shown. As soon as you complete it, roll out of the way because if not, he will jump onto you and put fire on the spot that he lands on. He will do this three times in a row. A good way to go by this is coordinate with your team and make sure that everybody's not spreading it all over the place. If you spread it in the middle of the room, it gets really hard because you got to fight him on the sides. Rather than fighting him in the sides, you should make it a priority to put these pits of fire on the sides of the arena. That way you have the middle and everything else to work with. And other than that, it's pretty much just rinse and repeat and just DPS him down.
that's gonna do it for today's video thank you guys for watching like comment and subscribe and i'll see you next time stay awesome